All right, squad, squad, we're back against the Chiefs. We got Broncos versus the Chiefs. We have a new quarterback, Haskins Jr. versus Mahomes. Quarterback with great potential, half a billion dollar worth. This is quarter two of our game versus the Chiefs. We started off that first game with a clean and clinical showing, and I think we're going to be able to bring that as well back onto the offensive side. But right now we had our defense playing a little bit on the back foot. Because Mahomes can play uh, very good in the uh, clutch throws, as we'll say it. So we want to make sure we close that down here. And we're going to be bringing it back right about now with some of his throws. But we're going to be making sure our coverage is both blitz and range. But we're also going to keep those man-on-man -man plays because... If they get open, then I think Mahomes is going to be able to have that vision to see it. And again, right there, as I was saying, he has that vision to see it. So we're going to need we're going to clean that up. We're going to need to uh, crank back that man on man to a closer closer range. Let's see how the blitz goes. We can get that blitz with some pressure on there. Nope, they just run right there. They just run. They can't be porous like that. They can't be porous. I think we can do another blitz run on here. And as I was saying, we're stepping back into the driver's seat. Can get some blitz on here. Come on, get through there, get through that. Ah, no, they went off the side. But if, even if they go off the side, look at that. We have strong players. They can, they can really dig deep. They can dig deep. And they can, they can hold them back. So, you know, we got the Broncos. We got that full stallion power. It's all right there. All right, he, oh, come on. Good, good tackle. That was a good tackle. He almost had that reset, but he got that. Got that broken up. And now we're only down on the fourth. Well, down on the fourth. They're gonna try and go for it. And um, they're probably gonna be able to do it. They got they got strong kick. Yeah, right here. It's it's straight with the flag. Ah, uh, that's not supposed to happen. Why why what we're not supposed to be getting this flag on here. You can't come on, you're good. You're good on defense. Don't give them that opportunity. Because now they're they're now they're on the touchdown. Right there, we had a great dip point differential, and we would have that momentum. Now they have the power to get that touchdown. And oh, they're right on that line. So close. If he just had his feet a little bit further out, he could have got that. All right. Come on, defense. We, we need to make sure we hold, we hold them back. So, all right, very good. Very good jump in there. Very good jump tackle and blocking them. We still have two more downs to take this. And they're on that one. They're on that one yard. As long as we're able to, to cut that pass. Eh, they got that pass right there. That was a bad that was a bad flag. Not gonna lie, that was a bad penalty. I, I, that if, if something bad happens in this game, that's gonna be that's gonna be where we look back at this. We can't have that type of opportunity just given to the other team on a silver platter like that. Especially when we're going up against a Super Bowl potential team. No, we can't have that working out in, that favor, in their favor. So right now, we're going to receive it. Oh, look, that's a good reception. I'm not going to lie, that was a good reception. We got some solid yardage on that. 27 wasn't like the same as the first score, but man, we got 31. 27 still solid. Now we got Haskins Jr. out there again. He's going to be really showing what he can do here, making some runs. Yes, exactly, making those runs happen. Opening up that opportunity. It looked like it was going to go far to the, to the right over there, but they all clumped up and it led right where Haskins was at that corridor in the middle there. And that's the type of plays we want to be making, but that's the type of strategy that comes from the quarterback. It comes straight from the field right there. All right, don't get don't get hit there. All right, at least he threw it out. At least he threw it out. He was going to take those yards back. I know in some previous games, Locke had his position exactly like that, where the uh, defense on the other team was able to break through, and they got that sack, and they, he wasn't able to get that throw out. All right. I was saying before, we need to hit that clinical gameplay. Look, their, their coach is frustrated there. You can see it. But we just need to keep pushing on that. We need to keep that pressure on. Long crew push down. But it looks all right now. Haskins is going to be going for that long ball. And it's all right. We can do that. That's peak Bronco ball play, as we all know. And, oh, he just had he had that so close right there. And, again, the Bronco ball style is not to give up on the fourth down. We play every down. We play every yard. We play down to the last second of every quarter. We can't. 
So th this is where Haskins really shows if he fits into our scheme. And right now he is. Um, he gets over. Get oh, that was a good. You see, that was a clean ankle breaker right there. Not just getting past the, the for first down, but getting past that. If he if, if that defender had blocked, he could have prevented that first down. But you see, Haskins right there. He didn't go into. He, he did the clean play. He did a clean play going around. Just a quick little cut. Change that body position. Roll it. Relaxed it. Moving around on the side right there. That was that was great. It was brilliant. And it does he does look like he has a great opportunity for the entire team here. And clean play again right there. And it's a touchdown move. That was that was great sight. But it was also great uh I would say a cut through into the center that had a had, had a quarter. It was just sitting there. It was a chasm sitting there because the other receivers had uh, drifted and made the opposing defense drift out. And right now we're already we're already taking that momentum. As long as as long as we don't get another bad flag like we had on the prior rush or drive of the Chiefs, then we're able to take this. I think we're able to take this. And that's going to be pretty good momentum because we don't need, we don't want to make any more roster cuts or changes. If we can just go with this team we have now, uh, our overall is up. We do have a stronger statistical representation of our strengths. As long as we can keep that up and we prove it on the field, we'll be going into a few games that will that will test us. That will definitely test us. Look at this right here again, though. What was that? Mahomes basically just got that whole breakthrough there. A solid rush. I can't fault him for that. It was it was on our our defense right there. And he's doing it again. He just pulls back out of that pocket, and he just takes off. And it was wide open. Oh, we got a fault. Oh my goodness, that there. Oh, that's a per this is a perfect play right here. Did we did we get that? I think we got that turnover right there. It was loose, and we did. 100% clean. And as I always say, that defense, our defense, you can anticipate an interception, a turnover, something. You can anticipate that. That's why we can rely on them and trust on them. And that's why we do every quarter, or every down we can. We play into third and fourth because we can rely on our defense to hold them back. All right, Haskins is going, he's going to run out. Yep, get that, get that clock stoppage right there. And by going over edge, and it looks like he's got a good setup here. We're letting him play some of these, uh, call some of these plays on his own right now. We want to give a little bit of that autonomy to see really, how do you say, what opportunities arise and what response is made or decided. Because opportunities always will arise some forced some unforced coming from errors on the other team but what really comes down to is a good mark of talent is how one decides what one decides under that pressure of a short-lived opportunity and you know on the field here it can be a it can be a second that can make a break a touchdown play and once again he saw yeah he saw that was first down potential he just needed to take it over the line, and he's strong enough to be able to do it. I'm liking what we're seeing from Haskins Jr. here. Uh, I'll probably switch back and forth because I, you know, when I see his jersey, I'm going to be called the same Jr. But uh, sometimes we just call him Haskins. But uh, he's a strong player so far. So, so far, a strong player, and I think we're going to be going into the next half and the third quarter with good momentum. As long as we can keep this up, hold them down, I think we're going to come out of this game. Swimming pretty. I think we're going to be having some great momentum. And we all things will be looking up. So, all right, squad, squad. Again, your advice is paying off. We come together as management team. What can I say other than usual? Stay toasty. I'll see you in the third quarter.